when did you find out he was in? Um, I found out about about a week or two ago. It, they, they kind of... Um, part of me doesn't ever want to know because I like to view it as a viewer still and, and kind of have that surprise on launch night. But um, now I kind of... Sometimes I have to know because I've got to do research on people that... I have possibly not heard of them before, <laughs> um, especially because this series is UK versus USA. So there are some American housemates that that are, um, you know, from reality shows in the States that I may not have seen. So I got told a couple of weeks ago and was very happy. I'm very, I, I really hope Janice Dickinson's in it because I think she'll be a fireball. Well, she was amazing in the jungle, wasn't mm. she? I, used to, I did the spin-off show when she was in there and she was just brilliant. So if she is in there, I think at least we know we've got someone that's going to deliver. Have you told Matt at home? Yeah. Please tell me you have. Yes. Oh, what did he say? <laughs> yeah. he, he gets really excited by it. I didn't realise it was 2002 that you started because everybody sort of has this thing about, you. wow, she's just hit our screens. But you've been a presenter for a long time now. Yeah. Yeah. Tw 11, 12, 13. Ooh! Yeah, a long time, a long time. But it takes time, doesn't it? You know, it's... Um... It's not something... I mean, it, it can just happen overnight, but for me, it was a lot of chipping away, and um, I started at MTV, which was a brilliant training ground because you kind of get thrown in and mm. you either sink or swim. <laughs> and I kept swimming <laughs> as much as possible. So, yeah, it's, I've, I've been plugging away for a while. But there were times where you found it very difficult, weren't there? Yeah, I think with everything, isn't there? You know, you, you kind of find something that you like and you hope you're good at, but... Um, sometimes those doors don't open and sometimes they don't open for a long time and you kind of go, do I crack on and, and stick with it or do I just kind of, you know, cut my losses and move on and try something else? But um, I had chats with a few people that I knew in TV and they went, just keep going, just give it a bit longer, give it a bit longer. Auntie Ruth. And then Auntie Ruth, yeah. Um, she was brilliant, actually. So when you uh, came over to sort of the big screen and everybody mm. saw you doing all the things, was that quite daunting after trying for so long? Um, um, yeah, I suppose it was to a certain extent because I think I'd, I'd been doing it for quite a while and, and you kind of think, I'm not getting anywhere, so therefore maybe I'm just not very good. Oh, rubbish, you are so good. So there but, we but are. You can't I've just pointed my finger at you. <laughs> Thank you. But you can't help but think it, do you know what I mean? You, you, mm. you, you have those insecurities and, um, and then when I did get something, I would think, oh, do they really think I'm... OK, or am I ever going to come back? Are they going to ask me to come back? And I Do you think still it's... have that self-doubt? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. You and I think, um, you know, it, it, not as much now because the voice have kept me and Big Brother have kept me and that, that's, that's kind of made me go, OK, well, I'm, I know I'm good at these two <laughs> because they've asked me to come back. But for a long time, people didn't ask me to come back. I'd, I'd get a gig and it would never happen or I'd get replaced. And, but, you know, it's the nature of, of well, what we do. Well, that's ridiculous. You'll be around for a very long time. You're so we'll good. We'll see. Let's talk about home life. Yeah. Does he sing around the house and be a boy band member all the time, He Matt? doesn't jump with his guitar off the sofa, but he... <laughs> oh, that's real... I was hoping he would. <laughs> that's what I was hoping you were going to say. But he, do, he sings quite a lot. He always, he's always singing. or There's always music on. Um, but, no, he, you know... He doesn't... It doesn't... <laughs> he doesn't jump. How did you two meet? I interviewed him a bunch of times, but um, we, were, we just kind of... We knew of each other, and then we kind of started to see each other more um, in interviews and then out socially, and we just became friends, and then friends became and who a bit are, more. And who asked who first? Um, I, I, I asked him. Did you? Yeah, I chased him for a little bit, yeah. What did you say? Did you uh, ask him out on a date? Yeah. I <laughs> if it's rude, I got, don't... No, no, it wasn't. I, I, I was watching him on the telly and I thought I had such a good time with him, so I called up, um, I called up Simon Webb. From Blue? From Blue? Who was with him on the telly. They were on Takeaway together. And I said, can you pass my number on to him? And then he didn't call me. Oh, he didn't call you? No. How long did it take, please? A few days. And then when you got the phone call, you must have... Yeah, I was like, yeah, I don't play games. Let's, let's go out. <laughs> oh, how wonderful. I absolutely yeah. love that. Now, as well with The Voice, and that, I mean, it's, it's wonderful that you're doing that. And it, you were working with your complete and utter idol, Kylie Minogue. Because <gasps> didn't you have pictures of her on your wall? <clears> I did. I had pictures of her. I had a blonde perm like her. I had... You uh, didn't? Out, I had her... Out, I did, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had her albums. I had, I had, yeah, all of it. So when I met her before we started filming, we had a little... Um, meeting party because it was kind of all of our first year and uh, 
and I just, you know, when you meet someone that you just mm. idolised when you were growing up, I just gobsmacked, I didn't really know what to say, and I just went, oh my God, I love you, and I had a blonde perm because of you, and she went, oh my God, I'm so sorry. And it's like, no, 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 it's <laughs> oh, fine, it's fine. Um, and, and she's just the most wonderful person. So to, so to meet one of your idols who kind of delivers and is lovely was just...